This is an overview of my series of six videos about zero-gauge line passenger cars covering the period between 1915 and 1942. Each of these videos presents a series of passenger cars of a defined type and built during a defined period. It covers all models which are listed by the TCA Line Book Committee. In 1915, Leine introduced zero-gauge trains. The first video shows all types of passenger cars produced by Leine during that first decade. These line passenger cars were from the middle period of the pre-war time. The cars were now more colorful and of larger variety. Here you see the 710-712 set, which is probably the most impressive of the pre-war passenger cars. These line passenger cars were from the last period of the pre-war time. The smaller set usually consisted of two passenger cars and an observation. Here you see the Red Comet set with the 264 Streamline logo built between 1936 and 1937. These larger line passenger cars were from the last period of the pre-war time and the set consisted of a baggage, a pullman and an observation car. The 26, 13, 14, 15 set is shown with the 26 loco, the largest die-cast pre-war loco produced by Lionel besides the Hudson.
Here I show the lithograph passenger cars which Leiner took over from the previous competitor Ives. After the purchase of the Ives company, Leiner soon replaced the Ives name on these cars by Lionel. Some of these cars were quite popular and were sold in several variants. They were often sold as cheap sets as shown here. This last video shows all the streamlined passenger cars which were sold as sets with diesel and streamlined steam locos. It also shows the streamlined cars of the Hudson. At the end of the post for production, Leiner introduced also a set of scale passenger cars.